Hello there, in this quick guide I want to show you how to unlock the FPS in the First Kingdom Come Deliverance game on PC. And this is a fix for the overall gameplay while traveling the world and stuff and in the cutscenes as well. So first thing we need to do is to go to where the game is installed. Now if you have the game on Steam it's going to be in the following directory. Program Files 86 Steam, then Steam Apps and you're going to find it inside the common. It should be Kingdom Come Deliverance folder. But I have the game installed elsewhere, so I'll navigate to it here. Once in, you're inside the games folder, you go ahead and enable this option in the folder options. Show this, uh, the file name extensions. You can also find it here in the options. And then make sure this um, option right here is unchecked. Then apply OK. Now you can see the file name extensions. After that, we create a new text file. Then we change its name and extension like this and name it the following user.cfg. Click yes on this warning. Then after that, we go ahead and open it with a text editor. Then add the following and the number here should be the frame rate of or the refresh rate of your monitor or the desired frame rate you wish to play on. You can add the other command shown on screen if you wish to add that it can unlock the fps of cutscenes if you wish to do that after this we just go ahead and save the file then close this window we don't need it anymore then we go to our launcher if you have the steam launcher we go to the properties of the game and add the following and i'll leave it for you in the video description for you to copy and paste you can also do the same thing through uh, the shortcut of the game you just go to the end of the target and add the following and apply this continue and click on OK. Now if these two ways don't work, you can also do it by launching the game, then clicking on the back tick on your keyboard and typing the following exec space user and enter on the keyboard and that should apply all the commands that we have. You may not see the same commands uh, shown on screen here because I had different ones, but you should see the ones that you typed in the user.cfg file. So I hope this video helped you out and peace out.